A Disney classic has returned here to Milwaukee. Hit Broadway musical Beauty and the Beast is at the Marcus Center through the weekend. And Emily Jewell plays Mrs. Potts and Samuel Shirtlift plays Cogsworth. And they join us now with more about the show. Welcome to both of you. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you for having us. Well, I, you know, this is one of those classic Disneys where everybody probably has seen the movie. Can you talk about for those folks who have not seen the, the stage version, uh, is there anything different? Is it the same story but just out in live yeah, theater? Yeah, I mean, everything that you love about the movie is there. So you mm -hmm. have Be Our Guest, Beauty and the Beast, Gaston, Belle, all those characters and those favorite songs, but there is so much more. There is more music that um, Alan Menken and Tim Rice wrote to supplement the score. And... Um, Lots of lovely moments between all the characters. But Is that hard, Samuel? Like living up to a Disney movie? <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, it's a high expectation, yeah. but it's uh, it's kind of a joy to get in there and pull it off, you know, to succeed with it, so it's great. What kind of house do you have? I mean, is it a lot of little kids? Is it adults, you a nice know, mix? It's really a show for everybody. You definitely have lots of kids. You'll see those adorable girls in their bell dresses in the front row. Um, but a lot of people, you know, from my generation who grew up watching the movie, it's perfect for date nights, it's perfect for a girl's night out, yeah. you know, and the grandparents too, so everyone really loves it. Boy, and look at the staging too. That's a huge <laughs> cast. Yes, yes, 30 of us. Do you yeah. guys, uh, when you when you travel like this and you travel all over the country, I mean, you, you must be a tight group. You got each other to hang out with, and that's yes. that, right? We're a family. We really are. Definitely. I wanted to ask you, Emily. You, you went to yeah. Viterbo, which is yes, out I in La Crosse, La Crosse, right? Mm -hmm. So, what's it like yep. to be uh, so close to, to those uh, roots? It's so nice. I've gotten to see so many people from college. They've come out to see the show. My voice teacher came to Minneapolis, so she got to see me, and that was really lovely. It's. I loved my time at Viterbo. It's a fantastic school, and it was a nice, you know, small environment, so I got a lot of personal attention, mm -hmm. and I feel like it really helped prepare me for the real world and helped me grow a lot. I guess performer. it worked out okay, huh? Yeah, yeah right? so far so good. And Samuel, <laughs> you had a career change. Did you used to be a teacher? I was teaching public school in uh, Texas and uh, doing regional theater there, and uh, got a lot of encouragement to chase it professionally, and I did, so I moved to New York, and. And here I am. Wow, that takes a, a huge amount of courage, though. I mean, uh, to, to go ahead and say, look, I got a good thing going here. And I assume you liked teaching, yeah. right? So I was pretty good at it. Yeah, to drop that and then go chase, uh, that's an amazing thing that happened in your life. Uh, it was kind of crazy, you know, but um, I did it. So, and I, and I made a success out of it. So it's a great story, I guess. Well, congratulations to both of you. The show looks fantastic. I hope we can get some more people out there for you. You can find more information on Beauty and the Beast now playing at the Marcus Center. All of it's on our website, tmj4.com.